Hi, so in this video we will learn how to draw a perpendicular on a given line. Suppose this is a line from any given point P. So to draw the perpendicular first we will draw a circle with center point P and the radius of the circle will be in such a way that it will cut this given line in two distinct points. So let me draw the circle. So this is the circle from point P and this circle cuts this given line at two distinct points. Let me call this point as point X and this point as point Y. And now I'll draw two congruent circles with point X and point Y as their centers and the radius slightly more than the half of the length of the line segment XY. So let this be the first circle and let this be the second circle. And now I'll draw a line from point P to this intersection point. So when you are drawing using compass, you need not to draw the complete circle. You can just cut one arc here and another arc here. You need not to draw the arcs over this side because after this, I'm actually going to join the point P with this point of intersection and we can extend it if you want. And this line will actually be the perpendicular on the given original line. So this is how you draw a perpendicular from any given point to any given line. So what is the logic behind this exact procedure? So when you take point P as a center of the circle and draw this gray color circle, you are actually making an isosceles triangle over here whose equal sides are actually equal to the radius of the circle. And we also know the median drawn from the point where two equal sides of an isosceles triangle meet, that means this point is always a perpendicular bisector of the third side, which is x, y in this case. So we are actually making an imaginary isosceles triangle P, X, Y, and we get point X, Y, that is the base of the isosceles triangle. Then I draw the perpendicular bisector of the side X, Y, which will also be a perpendicular from point P. This is based on the fact that in any isosceles triangle, the median from the point where two equal sides meet is also a perpendicular bisector of the third side. So this is how we draw a perpendicular from any given point to any given line. And we have also learned why exactly this procedure works. So for many more interesting videos, keep watching MathSmart and bye-bye till then.